Retinoblastoma Eye Processing Part 1. Grossing This is an eye with retinoblastoma. A cut in the eye was made to remove tumor for genetic testing. First measure and document the dimensions of the eye. From superior to inferior. And anterior to posterior. Also measure and document corneal diameter. Use a ruler to get a measurement of eye length. Here, the optic nerve has already been removed. If optic nerve has not been removed, use a disposable blade to cut it off. Measure optic nerve. You may use ink to mark the resection margin. Measure diameter for both ends. Use a disposable microtome blade. Position the blade next to the optic nerve stump and slowly make an incision. The eye is now in two pieces with the tumor exposed. One pupil optic nerve piece or PO level right and one cap left. Estimate tumor size. Measure tumor base. Measure tumor height. Record anatomic location of tumor. Part 2. Processing. Cut a square from lens paper and soak it in saline. Place the tissue on lens paper. and wrap it. Place the wrapped tissue into a processing container. Include a label to identify the tissue by surgical number. Repeat same procedure for all gross tissue specimen, including the optic nerve. The tissues may be placed in 10% formula and temporarily as you work so they don't dry. Process the tissues as follows. 10% buffered formalin, 4 hours at 37 degrees Celsius, 70% ethyl alcohol, 1 hour at 37 degrees Celsius, 95% ethyl alcohol, 1 hour at 37 degrees Celsius, 100% ethyl alcohol, 4 hours at 37 degrees Celsius, xylene, 2 hours at 37 degrees Celsius, and paraffin wax, 2 hours at 60 degrees Celsius. Part 3 Embedding. Unwrap optic nerve. Using a disposable blade, cut optic nerve into two pieces. Fill metal embedding mold with melted paraffin wax. Place the non-cut end transverse section 
facing down. Top the mold with a labeled plastic cassette and secure with more wax. Repeat the procedure with the other end. Placing it with the inked end facing down. Unwrap the PO level. Repeat the embedding procedure as before. Flip the tissue in wax a few times to coat the structure. Finally, place the tissue in the mold with the cavity facing down. Top with labeled plastic cassettes and secure with wax. Repeat for all tissue specimen. Allow wax to harden for 15 to 20 minutes. Remove the embedding mold. Remove excess wax from edges to avoid interface with microtome. Part 4, Trimming and Sectioning. Here we demonstrate trimming of the cap tissue. Trimming removes the wax in front of the embedded tissue to achieve a full face. When you reach the tumor, you will hear a slightly different noise with each cut. The white part shown is the tumor. This block is not yet full face. More trimming is needed. Retinoblastoma tumor is hard and requires softening or decalcification. To decalcify tissue, make a solution of 3,000 milliliters distilled water 375 milliliters of formic acid, 375 milliliters of hydrochloric acid. Place blocks in the solution for approximately five minutes. Blocks may be placed on ice to cool wax to make sectioning easier. To section the block, set the microtome to make cuts of five micron thickness. Carefully and slowly cut to get a continuous ribbon. Place the ribbon that shows tumor into a water bath 8 to 10 degrees Celsius lower than the wax melting point. Using a pre-labeled slide, scoop a sample for this cap. Repeat this for each tissue. All sectioning is done. Put all slides on a rack to dry.